This Let's Play features an adult using adult language. You have been warned. How's it going, folks? My name is Steven Wolf. Welcome back to Let's Play The Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion. We completed the main quest. Wild feeling at that. Pretty, pretty cool feeling, not gonna lie. Like, getting that dialed in, of all things, I didn't expect it, but I'm proud of it. With the main quest completed, and now we have our normal space to explore and wander around. Um, we are a touch over encumbered. I should drop off some of our goodies at home. Mm. Well, we're going to be pursuing some DLC. Sideways Cave, Imperial Prison. One of these one, one of these has a, the location we need to go to. I'm going to ditch my stuff in Frostcrag because I do not want any of Manker Cameron's weird cool shit to leak into the world. There we go. I hope everyone's been doing well. It's a weird feeling for me, getting this far into Oblivion, because I've never... I think maybe once, once firmly maybe, I completed the main story. So I'm quite proud of the efforts that I put in, but it's it's a weird feeling, you know? All right, let's... Let's go with this crate. Weaponry. It's a good feeling. Put the claymore there. Storm staffs. Longsword. Mankar Mayrun. I never used Storm Ruler, huh? That was a waste of fucking inventory space. Alright. Put armor in this one. Imperial Watch Shield. Mankar Cameron's robes. I don't know how I have three mundane rings, but here we fucking are. Storm, flame, frost. Sweet! We have all of the rings. That's a good feeling. Um, hmm. Let's see. Apathy, frost, healing insight, sorcery strength, willpower, absorption, grounding, insulation, dispel, shock shield. Okay, next to the wine rack, we can do ingredients. 35 Ambrosia. Daedra Heart, Silk, Venom, Liquor. It just says Restore Magicka. So I think what I'll do is I'll keep like 10 with me of each. There we go. Got all these wine racks and bottles and shit. That's a cool feeling. Okay. And... In the partially sunken case, we shall put everything else, so... Dominate Creature, Electrocution, Flame Tempest, Ice Blast, Immolating Blast, Lightning Storm, we don't need the Mythic Dawn Commentaries, and Silence. As for keys, the game will correct me. Okay. The game will correct you on placing and hiding items that you might still need, be it in the pursuing a quest or working on something important. 
Which is a great feeling. It, it is a greatly appreciated feeling. Okay. We're down to 175. What the fuck? Keys I'll put in the inside of this barrel. There we go. Good feeling. And actually, I will take my keys. Because that's an easy way to keep track of stuff. Who the fuck am I kidding? Not taking my keys with me is a quick way of getting fucked over by the game. game wanted to remove the keys, they would have done it. It's also a cool sign of progress, you know? Alright, swords. What swords do I not need? I have... Yeah, I don't need Storm Ruler. Not gonna lie. It drops me to 129, because I've got a bunch of shit. I probably don't need 92 health potions. Maybe like 40. 47. 47 feels good. 107 weight. Alright. Feels good. Looks good. Smells fantastic. <sighs> Let's go see what shenanigans await in the DLC. Oh, uh, we need to wait, actually, because I want the Imperial Dragon Armor. Alright, fuck. Two weeks. We'll wait inside. Sure. That's 14 days. Yeah, I'll just do an edit for you guys. What the fuck? Oh. Auden Zavidius is dead. He was the crooked guard the Imperial City threatened that had threatened Laronk and Ruslan. Ooh, I have a note of his ramblings. Used to be somebody who was a captain of the guard of the Imperial City until that flea bitten hero decided to poke his nose in my business. Apparently there's a secret escape tunnel used by the royal family. I get I'm gonna sell the score with that hero, then I'll take care of those two snitches. Fun. Wait. I'll make him squeal first, okay. Shit. You're a fucking idiot. And now I have a body in my house. Great. That's annoying. That's really annoying. Actually, hold on. Aha! Imperial armor's ready. And now... If I fast travel and then wait. He'll know where to find me. Yep. What's 
the map. This might not have been a good idea. Yeah, that wasn't a good idea. We're going to wait out here. There we go. Jackalope. Okay. Fuck. I don't think I've ever actually been over here. It's cool, though. Ooh. Are you kidding me? There's Legion armor just laying around in here. And weapons and helmets. It's fine. I have the Imperial Dragon armor now. That's a good feeling. Is this better than what I'm currently wearing? Let's find out. Uh, seven, fifteen, seven, nine, seven. It's only better because I'd have a helmet. So hold on. Fifteen, nineteen. So no, it's not better. It's just a new set of armor. Cool though. Yeah, sixty seven versus eighty five. Damn. It is very cool. Which is precisely why I'm going to be. Putting it in my uh, my manor home. Skin grad, yeah, skin grad. Okay. There we go. And I have the display case. Fuck yeah. So now... A... See, personally, for me, if I was designing these for a gameplay reason, then I would simply say, well, it's the best armor in the game, so you can add multiple enchantments, or it's easier to repair, or something to that effect. Sir, I need you to sit up straight. Thank you. It's going to be too tall, isn't it? Ooh, yeah.
go. Perfect. And then from there, I can put the helmet and boots up top here. This right here is why later games have uh, armor racks. Later games like this, anything past fucking Skyrim. This, with the display cases, is why Skyrim has armor racks. There we go. Although an interesting thing to note, if you move something, it'll just go back to where it was. If you take something into your inventory and then place it, then it stays put. Hmm. Nice. Okay. Oh. Yeah, that's not going anywhere. Cool. Cool, cool. Let's go get into some shenanigans now. I have heard a rumor that a strange doorway has appeared in a small island in the Nibbin Bay. I should investigate. Should we? Should we really investigate? I appreciate that the gate stays closed. I'm doing this wrong. Nope, there it is. It's just really foggy out. Yeah, because that's normal. Guardsman. Here comes it's another one. Madness. Why? Why? Everything is wrong. It can't be done. Stay away from me. I won't go back. You can't make me go back. I will kill you all. You're all going to die. Stay back. This one's a pilot. Die, Kurt! 
Should I help him? They're gonna be at this all day. I'll let you get the killing blow so it doesn't count against me. Never mind. I'd stay back from that door if I were you. I don't know where it came from and I don't want to. Those who've gone in have come back out wrong. I'm just here to warn folks to stay away. What happened to them? Look for yourself. Their brains are addled. Got no sense. Perfectly normal people went in there. And this is what's come out. I'm going in. Ha! It's your funeral. I'm just here to warn people, not keep them out. Go ahead in. I'll be here to clean up the mess when you come out. Unworthy. Unworthy! A nice effort, though. Shame he's dead. <laughs> These things happen. Bring me a champion! Rend the flesh of my foes! A mortal champion to wade through the entrails of my enemy. Come in. It's lovely in the aisles right now. Perfect time for a visit. Uh. Do sit down. Yes, what can I do for you? I imagine you're here about the door. Yeah. Yes, you have entered, and now you are here. Amazing. Truly. Who are you? I am Haskell, Chamberlain to the Lord Sheagorath. Oh. Um, what is this place? You approach the Shivering Isles. Through the door behind me lies the realm of Sheagorath, Prince of Madness, Lord of the Never There. Why did that door appear in Cyrodiil? Because my lord wills it to be so. It poses no danger to Mundus. No compact has been violated. It is a doorway, an invitation. Perhaps you will accept it for what it is. What do you want with me? For you? I do not know. My lord seeks a mortal to act as his champion. As for his intent... To attempt to fathom it is a foolish endeavor. His will is his own. His reality follows suit. You are here because you chose to enter. You were not summoned. And the people outside? They entered this realm and were ill-prepared. Their minds are now the property of my lord. How can they be cured? Cured? You speak as if they are diseased. They live now in another state of being. Perhaps it is you who needs a cure. What happens now? You do as you will. You may leave the way you entered. Your life will be none the worse for your time spent here. Or you may continue onward through the door behind me. If you can pass the gates of madness, perhaps the Lord Sheogorath will find a use for you. And if I go through the door? Who is to say? There are always choices to be made. The realm of madness is no different in that regard. Your choices are your own. Enter or do not, but make your decision. I've other duties to which I must attend. Speak with me again when you have made up your mind.
Well, have you made up your mind? I'll do it. Fine. I'm sure my lord will be most pleased, assuming you ever manage to see him. You'll want to pass through the gates of madness. Oh, and mind the gatekeeper. He dislikes strangers to the realm. Enjoy your stay. I've entered the Shivering Isles. In order to find the Lord of this realm, I must first pass through the Gates of Madness. This place has always been very cool. Except for these fucking assholes. Grumite. They have eggs. And they have potions. What, what value is their soul? Greater. Okay, I'll take a greater. I'm good with that. Now, this place is weird and lovely and nuts at the same time. It's great. The game wants us to go that way. What's this way? Zetafen. Hello. Venomous Balawog. Cute. No treasure, though, so not that cute. <coughs> Bunch of burned out shit. This might be a way up, actually. Only technically. <laughs> Bitch. I'll 
take ten bucks. Sure. They got a pearl, okay. There's the way in. I should talk to the locals before barging in and stealing a bunch of shit. Or... No, I should talk to the locals. With my luck, if I start freelancing, I'm going to screw something up. Damn, this place is weird. Welcome to my town. The place was pretty deserted when I got here. Of course, once I was here, others followed. Can't say I blame them. They say the keys are sewn up in the gatekeeper's body. Basically, that means you're not getting in. He guards the gates of madness. See for yourself. He's about to destroy a party of adventurers. Oh dear. Don't feel bad that you're not as gifted as me. I'm J Red Ice Veins. Do you ever wonder why things look better without their skin on? For instance, you can only really see the bones when you take them out. You can hear them better that way, too. Oh, you're nuts. See you later. This is gonna go poorly. You there, stay away from the gatekeeper. Let us handle this. Show me what you've got. Ooh. I just want the guy in the ebony armor to die so I can steal his shit. The formidable gatekeepers destroyed the party. I should talk to the residents before trying to deal with this creature. Look at all the blood and gore. I'm getting out of here. He's too much. Killed all my men. Hmm. Well, that didn't go well for him. Through the fringes of madness. Alright, let's talk to the locals. I'm Felis Sarandis. Pretty scary, isn't he? Jared's planning on killing him. I don't know how. Jared? One leads to the lands of Minya. And one to Dementia. The gatekeeper makes sure no one gets in who isn't supposed to. It's a nice enough place, less dirty than others. I feel like I belong. That old man in the room made out of butterflies, he said to wait here. Hmm. Goodbye. So this place is nuts is what you're telling me. Got it. I should follow the orc. When he's done fleeing, he might have something important. He's too much. That and he's wearing ebony armor, so it should be highly amusing. 
I gotta say, I love the ebony armor in Oblivion. I prefer its design and aesthetic in Skyrim. Bro, where are you going? What is your pathing, dude? You crashed my game. Okay. And this is why you gotta save regularly, folks. You there. Stay away from the gatekeeper. Let us handle this. Damn. Is too much. Killed all my men. Get out of my way. I'm fellas. So if you have to fight a flesh atronach, a good shock spell is the way to go. Hmm. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I'm not following the orc this time. Fuck that. And I'm not thrilled about the game crashing as quickly as it did. I know half of that issue is because I'm, well... What are we now, like 80 hours in? Hello, crazy person. Hello, I'm Dredwin. No one was running this place when I got here. They left plenty of things behind, though. What do you need? What do you have available? Summer wine, cheap wine, Felmore. Good collection of shit. Heretical thoughts. Oh, fun. Protects the gates of madness. He'll kill anyone who gets near. Be mm. Go ahead. For me? Thanks. I feel like I need to be on the other side. So I've got two potential leads. Oh. What is it? What have we here? Another hopeful whose blessing hasn't fully taken root? No, I don't think so. You're an adventurer? How disgusting. Why don't you go back the way you came? I got too much shit to do, Dunmer. The gatekeeper is my child. The consummation of Sheagorath's wisdom in the womb of my genius. Ugh. It was a painful and bloody birth, but well worth it. His brothers were less successful. He won't bother those blessed by Lord Sheagorath. You, however, will die trying to get the keys from my child. I am blessed by Sheagorath. You? No, you have a conventional type of soul. But I don't make that decision. The Shivering Isles belong to Lord Sheagorath. 
Were it up to me, I'd cut you open and show you just how uninspired your blood is. And you would die. No, you won't be getting in. I will find a way. I'm bored with you. Why don't you talk to Nanette? She likes... There's one sure way to stop a tongue from flapping. Hmm. Place is bothersome. So there's someone out that way. Sheldon's house. Who the fuck is Sheldon? Oh, Sheldon, right, okay. Madness or fun. Where's this? Nanette. There we are. What? Hello, I'm Nanette Don. I wasn't sure why I came here until she showed up. Now I know. I'm going to be a powerful sorceress. Just like Relmina. Do you hear that sound? It's like a horse dying. He's Relmina's crowning achievement. She made him in the gardens of flesh and bone. She's my teacher. She's going to teach me all her secrets. Oh, and this is really interesting. Wait. Oh, never mind. My big mouth almost just got me in trouble again. It's just down the road from Passwall. I'd like to... I'm listening. Every little bit helps. That's pretty good. Not now. No more. I doubt it. See? Was that hard? That works for me. I've been dying to tell someone. You seem trustworthy <laughs> enough, but don't tell Relmina I said anything. Of course not. The gatekeeper is flawed. Her tears hurt him. How did tears hurt him? Her tears somehow agitate the Daedra bound to the gatekeeper's body. Her tears make it really restless. It strains harder against the warding magic. She may seem like a tough woman, but the gatekeeper makes her all weepy. Go, see for yourself. She visits him every night around. Just don't tell her I said anything. I might get another lesson in the nature of pain. I don't like those lessons very much. Mm. Can't get in without Shea Gareth's blessing. That's what Romina says. That's the reason we're all waiting here. For Shea Gareth's blessing. Hmm. Oh, and I guess there's keys sewn up inside the gatekeeper's body. Not sure why someone would do that. It's not like anyone can get them now. I don't know who built it. It was here before any of us arrived. Dreadwin's been selling what they left behind. So, if you need something, talk to her. The Argonian Bighead is always searching for the Fork of her repilation. <laughs> Somebody stop that awful racket! Some highly amusing people. Right. So there's a cave nearby. Do I have a map? Oh. I do have a map. What's this cave nearby? I like how I say cave, and it's actually like a stone structure. Gardens of flesh and bone. Okay. A very easy lock. 
Right, I need to take care of something. I shall return. All right, we're back. Okay. Weird place of flesh and bone. What the fucking... Cool. Let's try this. Okay. Bone shard. Oh, fun. Bone marrow. Gatekeeper skeleton. Wait, what am I doing? I can also talk to Jared about killing the gatekeeper. Okay. So, I feel like I might have wasted a little bit of time, but at the same time, I found a body, which could be useful. We'll see. Let's talk to Jared. Oops. I'm going this way. I'm J Red Icebait. I want him dead. I need him dead. His bones are calling to me. Rumor has it you want him dead, too. If you're any good with a lockpick, we can help each other out. They say the gatekeeper's magical. I don't believe in magic, but I do believe in bones. And the best way to kill something is with the bones of its own. I can see the bones of a dead gatekeeper in the courtyard of the... You'll pick that lock, and I'll collect the bones. Wait, let's do this later. Hurry up! Take care. I'm curious why the one chick cries. Right, we gotta wait until midnight. Fancy. Hello? What was that? Take care. Alright, so let's see here.
so glad to see you. Dear child, how are you? I see you've been playing rough with the other boys. You're weak and you are strong. Just looking at you reminds me of him. Why has he forsaken us? I'm sorry, child. It's just too much for me. I must leave now. No, you mustn't come near me when I'm crying. You remember what happened last time you touched my tears? guy whoa um I'm not sure what happened there <laughs> hundred and twenty seconds or I can give him arrows. Nah. I can handle this. Go through either door. Which one's which? Mania fits my style more. Must speak with Haskell first? Oh, hey. So. You've managed to kill the gatekeeper. Pity. Well, you'll now be able to enter the realm proper. You'll notice there are two doors. One leads to the lands of Mania, the other to Dementia. Enter through either one. The lands are quite distinct, but both are Sheagorath's domain. You'll want to seek out Lord Sheagorath. I believe he has plans for you. Try not to disappoint him. The lands of Mania are bright, vibrant, and full of color. You'll find its inhabitants reflect the land itself. Hmm. If you wish to meet the residents of Mania, you'll find them in the settlements of Hale and High Cross. Take care, though. Though the citizens and creatures of Mania are colorful, they can often be quite deadly. I'm sure you can handle it, though. It is, of course, the capital of the Shivering Isles. It is divided into Bliss, Crucible, and the Palace Districts. Hmm. The doorways into the realm proper. You may enter through either one. Really, it depends on which aspect of the realm more suits your disposition. As I've said, all choices have consequences, but don't trouble yourself too much with your decision. All those that enter the realm are forever changed, but some believe it is for the better. A good portion of them, at least. The lands of dementia reflect the darker side of its residents. It is easy to get lost among the tangle of roots growing out of the ground. If you wish to meet dementia's citizens, seek them out in Deepwallow or Felmore. I'm sure they'll welcome one such as you with open arms. He is the Prince of Madness, the ruler of the Shivering Isles. It is by his will that we exist in this place. He is our Lord and Master. You'll want to speak with him soon, as I believe he has plans for you. It is best not to make Lord Sheagorath wait. His whims are fleeting, and should he decide you are no longer necessary, it would be to your detriment. You will enter soon, I imagine, through the Gates of Madness and... 
It is the realm of Lord Sheogorath. It is what he wills it to tread lightly in the aisles. It is not a place suited to all mortals, but I'm sure you'll do fine. Mildly concerning. I live to serve. All right. Mania. Blessing of Mania added. The fuck is that? Or is that a spell? Ah, frenzy up to level 12 and 30 feet for 30 seconds. It's not the most useful thing. All right. Let's seek out Shagorath. Is it map marker added? Oh boy. Bliss, New Sheo, and Crucible. All right. This should be exciting. Looks like there's a camp nearby. I just want the tent. Hard Scrabble Camp. Oh boy, here we go. Well done. Just had a Daedric longsword. This is fine. All right. Black tar, chromite eggs, stray alcohol, iron arrows, and a crystal ball. Fun. Okay. Stray goodies. My dagger. All right. So there's not much going on here. It's unfortunate. Let's get back to the road. We were going this way. You can see the difference. Holy shit. Now, I am sure that I'll end up exploring this place fully and totally as things progress. I don't think I've ever actually fully played through Shivering Isles. I, I, I know I've beaten it, but I don't remember a damn thing from it. For better or for worse. Hmm. Actually, you know what I think I'm going to do? After I get this camp locale, after I get this for her. Longtooth camp. Okay. Hello? Really? Oh no, another spellcaster. What the fuck are you? I didn't need to see that. More 
heretic apparel. Okay. Stray food, stray food. Let's grab all of this. I feel like before we really delve in, I should... Heretical thoughts. Zealotry is an abomination that must be wiped from the Shivering Isles. We cannot suffer their beliefs to spread to even one more soul. They name us heretics for a lack of belief. We gladly accept the name. We'll make an honorable one. Hmm. Interesting. Fork of Heripolation? Just, just laying around. The fuck? Okay. Worth five gold, has no weight. It's a quest item. Two damage. Cool. Oh, that's going to be in my inventory for a while, isn't it? Okay. Yeah, what I need to do before we really get stuck in is handle a particular side quest back in the Heartlands. Stay away from me. You can't see me. You can't see me. Right. Uh, yeah. We need a lesser soul gem, a head of lettuce, and some yarn as an offering to the statue. Yeah, I'm sure I can find that. Hmm. <laughs> will I help you eat or will I help you sleep? Which would you prefer? Mm. I'm Alright, let's see what we can get. Ooh, robes of creativity. We need a head of lettuce. Lesser soul gem, a head of lettuce, and some yarn. We all owe you a debt of yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do business. Common, folded, stray dumb shit. A good price for a. Thank you. I could probably get these from the Mages Guild. That would make the most sense. Ooh. And Warlock's Luck. He might have some goodies for me. Take a chop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> have a look around. You won't Fucking find dork. Have a look around. You won't find better prices in hmm. old Tamriel. No, but I might find better items. Hello. Hello. Well met, guildmate. What is it? It's my pleasure. How it's my pleasure. Let's do business. No. Oh, wait, you well, can train people. What do you train? There's much I can show you. Destruction. Knowledge. Let's see if we... I can show you. Four. I can show... Five. Nice. Goodbye. A pleasure to... You don't train or do much. Okay. You're what in. Now that hen and... You don't really do much. I, do I think all Grogalish cares about is... Good day. I offer the finest... Always keep your... Knowledge is the key to... Mysticism. Farewell. He obviously takes great pride in the... So good. 
You don't have a shop. Good morning. So I've heard. Oh, there's yarn. All right, that's one. Need a lesser soul gem. It can't be. Without question. All the times I've sold a lesser soul gem and I finally fucking need one. A lot of times they're just left lying around, too. There's lettuce, just need the soul gem. I mean, it's a mage's guild. There should be like one or two just strewn about. And that's why I'm glad I still have my mage's guild key. What's going on with you? I heard people saying they I ran. heard people saying they ran into goblins around here not long ago. Petty. I can't. It's my plan. I offer the finest goods and lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. I need a lesser soul gem. Grand isn't too terrible though. There's much I. I offer the finest goods and. Goodbye. Lesser. Oh, well, take care. There Morning. we go. Now I just gotta find his shrine again. Oh dear. This is for this is for a reason. This is for a good reason. I like the idea of going through the Shivering Isles with his staff. It'd be funny. Sanguine. Well, let me leave town, then I should have an arrow. Malakath. Hermaeus Mora, Azura, Periite, Hircine, Clavicus Vile, Nocturnal. Where the hell was? Shigora, there we go. You've been told what she I'll be here. Y'all are goofy. Does my champion summon me? Before I've even told you what to do? Oh, that's not very championy, not at all. This is when I should smite you. Give you a serious smite. Completely smitten. When I tell you to do something, I generally mean it! I suppose there's something I can have you do while you're here, though. A little errand, and a lot of fun. There's a little settlement called Border Watch. It's a nice, peaceful place. And dull. Dull, dull! They're going to make their lives interesting. They're a superstitious bunch. Everything is an omen or a portent. 
Let's make one come true. Find their shaman and ask about the Kashara prophecy. After I left the requested items at the shrine, Shagoroth spoke to me. Board a watch. Right near water's edge. Oh yeah. Surprised the bodies are still out and about. Ugh. Oh, hell, who's fighting what? Oh, he's gonna die. All right, guardsman. Not really. Oh, he holds still, yeah. Now would be the perfect time to test liquor. That should help you out. That barely does shit. Okay. There's a town on the way. Don't mind me, just hauling ass into the village. Hello. Welcome to our town, friend. A stranger who knows about the Kashara prophecy. It is one of our many prophecies. You should speak with Rebasa, our shaman. Rebasa is our shaman. Good day. With you. I ran across a couple of Mostly a cat I village, okay. Village. Welcome to Border Watch, stranger. I am Rebasa. Yes. You're not going to be sure how to feel about this one. You know of the Kashara prophecy. How odd. Are you some sort of scholar? One could say that. I'm a traveling scholar. Wonderful. I would be glad to tell you more. It has been told from our fathers and our fathers' fathers that our time in this place will come to an end. My great-great-great-grandfather, Kishara, foretold of a time when we would receive three signs from the gods, signaling the end of the world. These are the signs as they were foretold. First, there is the plague of vermin. It is said our town will be overrun by disease-carrying creatures. Mm. Rats, I would imagine. Horrible little things. I always keep a powerful rat poison around in case I see one of the little monsters. Next is the plague of famine. It is foretold that our livestock will fall dead in their fields with no apparent explanation. We have but the six sheep in our pasture, and we make sure they are well tended. 
And the third sign? The plague of fear. Uh, I will not speak of this. Not to any outsider. I'll answer anything else I can. Is there something more? Perhaps you would like to know more about Border Watch itself. Yeah, yeah, tell me about the town. I'm glad you asked. I could go on all day about our little community. We are but a handful of Khajiit, as you can see. Many are the evenings we spend around the cooking fire, sharing stories of elsewhere. The smell of our food travels for a mile. Hmm. If you'd like to stay, I'd suggest getting a room at the Border Watch Inn. We don't get many visitors, but Setasa serves a fine ale. She also has the finest collection of cheeses in the Empire. Her prized cheese has such a powerful aroma. She keeps it sealed in a case. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're making this too easy. Don't make it that easy for me. Come on. Welcome to the Border Watch Inn. We don't get many visitors. Please feel free to stay a while. Oh, of course. Take a course. seat, or feel free to look around. We have a fine collection of cheeses here, some of the rarest in all Tamriel. What can I interest you in? Cheese. All right. See, was that hard? It's been a hobby of mine for years. I've collected cheeses from all over Tamriel, including the rare Olroy cheese. Olroy, who? A more pungent cheese you'll never find. It looks smooth, but it stinks to the heavens and beyond. I keep it locked away tight. If I were to try cooking with it, the smell alone would draw rats for miles. It's a lovely conversation piece, though. Hmm. Yeah, I'd like a bed for the night. There's a room if you need it. Of course, I'll take okay, it. Okay, then. Room number one, right next to the entrance. Mud crabs. What's the point? Goodbye. Yeah, this is nice. This is really nice. I'm gonna ruin their entire society. Today's beer. Aged spicy lager. Okay. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. So what I'm going to do Hey there. You're always welcome in Border Watch. I need to find a fire. Oh, there it is. The smell coming from it is astounding.
to get up at eight. Yep. Oh. You've seen it. You've seen the first sign. Perhaps this is the beginning of the Kashara. Take your time. That will get you, son. It has come. We're doomed. You can't be too careful out in the wilderness. Good day. Oh yeah, he's believing it. You've seen it. It has come. We're doomed. It has come. We're doomed. Doomed. Run while you can, stranger. Get out. Take your time. Bye. Yeah, he totally believes it. Why are the sheep out and about? I can poison it, can't I? Yeah. They're going to want me to... They're, they're well tended. And the rats are all dead. Instantly. Awesome. Was there more rat poison, or was that it? God's protect mud crabs. Bye. It's a bit hostile. You've done well, mortal. I'm amused, I think. Head into the center of Border Watch and make sure to dock. Uh-oh. That can't be good. The Kashara. You can't. No, we're all doomed.
The Kashara has come true. Doomed. We're all doomed. For the love of Azur. The end of all... So they're having a bad day, understandably. <laughs> Fuck. Good work. Good times. Here's a little reward for your efforts. One of my toys. Now, back to business. Before I forget myself. Shagorath has rewarded me for my efforts by giving me Wabajack. I think that's the perfect sign that I'm worthy of this dumb shit that I'm about to pull. Wabajack on target. <laughs> All right, where was I? Longtooth Camp. There we are. Okay, they are still dead. That's good. Let's keep it going. Elder Gnarl. Cool. I've been silenced. I should probably re-equip the main quest. There we go. There's another camp up there. I should go investigate that. There we go. Like, oh, you spotted something weird and different. Let's go see what's out there. Well, the hell out there, aren't they? Ah. A little burrow. Okay. Oh, oh there they are. Up. I need to go up. This place is weird. We found wretched camp. I mean, it's not that wretched. A bit plain, yes. Wretched? I wouldn't say wretched. Red kelp gas bladder. Now it's pretty wretched.
bitch. Come on, dude. What was the plan there? You were just going to run at me and try and kill me anyways. Come on. Okay. So far, so good. The Lightning Coast. The Isle of Flame. Overlook Road. Yeah, we'll get there. There's a cave on the way. In. Oh, you're having a bad one, aren't you? That was a waste. That was a heckin' waste. Okay. We found a cave. Dire Warren. Cool, I guess. Amber. All right. Stop that shit.
Not bad. Whoa. These amber stumps, I get the feeling, are going to be incredibly useful. All right. That's a door. That's definitely a door. Ring of Speed. Amber Mace Matrix? Whoa. Looks like a mold of some kind. Seems magical. Someone in the aisles should know what it's used for. Antipodian Hammer. Okay. Matrices. Interesting. So dungeon crawling in this is going to be incredibly helpful. All right. Well done, dumbass. from yeah damn things are sturdy Well done. I'm annoyed that there isn't like a treasure chest or something down here. I think I probably have to come mountaineering. See that? Yeah. Nope. Oh, just barely. All right. Sucks. 
Why did you attack? Oh, Mace of Rending. That could be cool. Bro, I didn't know you. I didn't do anything to you. You attacked me. Butthole. Why do you have a journal? Why should I care? Lucy has been very nervous the past few days, even thinking about packing and moving out of here. I'll hear nothing. Christmas studies in peace. I have not pressed the matter, for I know she is true to me. I spent two hours waiting for my Alyssa to return from her daily bath near the waterfall. She fell asleep. Past few days, Alyssa has brought up the subject of leaving this place. Alyssa spent nearly four hours stay at the waterfall. She said she fell asleep again. She burst into tears and confessed she no longer wished to stay here with me. That night, I did not sleep, and the day's events played over. That was the last I saw of Alyssa. Only time will heal my heart. I can now. It seems I have all the time in the world alone. I've done the right thing. I had no right to keep her here against her will. The only thing that keeps me sane is knowing she is happy once again and free to do what she wants. I must stay strong. Uh, she might be dead, dude. Oh. This place is weird. I wonder if there was a different waterfall spot. Mm, that's the way out. Interesting. Alright, well, I feel I collected everything. Probably like a chest or two that I missed. I found a weapon matrix. That's gonna be weird. This way. Come on. So she might be dead. He might have killed her. <sighs> Tough call. Let's go this way. 
I should probably head to the main city first while picking up locations here and there. That makes the most sense to me. Whoa. What the fuck was that? Ooh, somebody's fighting. There she goes. Okay, that was cool, I think. Camp Tall Trees. Yeah. Yeah, those trees are pretty tall. <laughs> I don't have any riveting commentary on that one. That's just fact check true. Okay, here we go. Right, the Overland Road. Should be where we could go next. All right. This area is strange. It's cool and it's lovely, but it's strange. Like, what is that? There's like a fortress over there. I should go that way. I should go this way and see if there's anything to do. Yeah. car. Whoa. Shit. Yeah, I'm not up for fighting these fucking things. There's probably shitloads of them. Just running away. Whoa. I no longer care. Y'all are trying to keep up anyway, so I don't care. There's a cave over on yonder. And also a village? Probably right there. This is strange. Hmm. Hello. Speak quickly. New Sheoth is the capital of the Shivering Isles. We Oriole guard Bliss, 
the manic district of the city. Sheogorath rules the Shivering Isles. We, the Oriole, are his favored soldiers, the most perfect expression of his might. The domain of the Prince of Madness, Shiv. Go. Speak quickly, mortal. Hmm? I just think you're hot. Damn, okay. Camp Hopeful. Okay, you know what, this would be a good place to stop. We've got a little bit of road left, but I've also been recording for yeah, about two hours. Roughly two hours. What time is it? Yeah, I got way too much shit to do today, unfortunately. I did start late. That's on me. Good place to stop, though. We've got some pretty sturdy equipment. We've got... Highly amusing souls and soul gems. Let's see what sort of trouble we can get into. Fortunately, we're out of time for today, folks. So, until we meet again, stay classy, Internet.